click the bell icon to get latest videos from Ikeda. Hello friends, in today's session we are going to study about nano materials. Nano, the word means small. It is extremely small. If I take one meter and cut it down to one million parts, then one millionth of the entire meter will be my nanometer. That small is the word nano. In today's session we are going to study about nano materials. And before that, we'll have to study about nanoscience and nanotechnology because both of them will help us in studying nanomaterials. Let us see all of these in detail in this session. <music> nanomaterials are small materials. And to study these, we need nanoscience. Now, nanoscience is the study of materials at the macro level. That means at the molecular or the atomic level or at times even at the subatomic levels. That means whenever we study certain substances at the atomic level or the molecular level, that entire study is known as nanoscience. We have another thing known as nanotechnology. Now this technology studies about the structures of the various devices and various components. Nanotechnology is a very important part in the study of nanomaterials because nanotechnology helps us in studying and getting the different designs, the different structures, characteristics and properties of various nanomaterials. Nanomaterials are extremely small materials. They are one millionth of a meter. That means 10 raised to minus 9 times of a meter is a nanometer. And the materials are known as nanomaterials. So if I want to find out a nanomaterial, a nanomaterial of a nanometer can be 6 carbon atoms in a straight line or 10 hydrogen atoms in a straight line. Now these 6 carbon atoms or 10 hydrogen atoms, both of them are extremely small to look with naked eyes. And that is the reason why we need an extremely powerful electron microscope to look through it. With the help of electron microscope, we can actually see these nanomaterials. We can also see the shapes of them. Most of them are rod, rod shaped, some of them are spherical, some of them are flat or disc shaped. The spherical shapes are also known as the clusters. So in today's session we studied about what nanomaterials are, what nanoscience is and what nanotechnology is. We studied nanomaterials, how we can see it and the different shapes of it as well. Thank you so much for watching this video. Stay tuned to Ikeda and subscribe to Ikeda.